my loves. Welcome to the channel. It's so nice to see you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in to my collective readings. I haven't seen you guys in there, okay? I do read comments. Taurus, got your candle lit. Ooh, yeah, Taurus. Okay. <laughs> okay, Taurus, so let's see what's going on in your energy right now, okay? What's going on in your space? What does Spirit want to let you know? Okay, Spirit's very good at that. Spirit, I ask you for you to please. Spirit, God, angels, universe, please bless my dear Taurians at this time. Please keep them focused. Please keep them strong and give them the greatest clarity that they possibly can get from this reading. May they not feel lost. May they feel led. And that you would please continue to keep them protected from anything that is of evil, anything that is not of you. Spirit, anything that's not of their highest good. Protect their family, their loved ones, and their children and their homes and continue to take care of them. In Jesus' name we may pray. Amen. Okay, Torians. My nails are still jacked up, but that's all right. It's okay, Taurus. If you're under the age of 18, please exit, okay? I know you guys get tired of hearing me say that, but it's like really, it really bugs me when YouTube bugs me about, you know, my channel being in children, children cursing. and you know, What the fuck, okay? <laughs> what the fuck, okay? <laughs> Come on now. Come on now. Okay, let's see, Spirit. What do we got for our Dertorians, okay? At this beautiful time, Spirit. Thank you, Spirit, so much for the beautiful messages. What does Taurus need to be aware of? What's going on in their life right now? What's going on, Spirit? What is going on? All right, let's see. Uh -huh. Taurus, I hope you guys are all doing well, okay? I wonder what you guys are eating for dinner. <laughs> Taurus, look, that don't, please, don't be, I, you guys, look, I, <laughs> when I have conversations with people, I wonder what they're having for dinner. I don't know why. Maybe it's because I'm a fatty, I like to eat, but I know y'all like, y'all got good taste in food, so what's up? Okay, Spirit, what do we have here for my dear Taurians? What would you like them to be aware of? What do they need to know? Oh, wow. There's my baby Torian right now at the door. Like, what? <laughs> yes. What, baby? What, what? Are you done with your food? Yes. You are? Okay, do you want some cookies? Okay. No, Mom. Thank you, Mom. Huh? There you go. All right. There you go. Let's go sit down. What? Yes. Y'all don't eat up all these Oreos. I want to make fried Oreos tonight. Eat all of them? No, you're not eating all of them. And they're the red ones. They're the Christmas ones. I want to make them. No, you make it all of them? No, uh, maybe. Mama. Everybody's going to want some. Mama. What, baby? Um. I love you. Mm. You know? Okay. So can I do my reading now? I can read? Can I? Do I have your permission? Okay, thank you so much. I love you. I'll be in there in a minute, okay? Thank you, babe. Oh, gosh. Okay, okay, okay. Baby Taurian and baby Aquarius. Okay. <laughs> Maybe I'll deal with Aquarius, okay? Dark thoughts in the reverse. We got new. Okay, wait. Are these? Oh, I'm reading. Okay, these aren't reverse. Okay. All of them are upright. Okay. So we got dark thoughts, okay? We got new supportive connections. And then we have increase. Oh, wow. Taurus, baby, what you got going on? This isn't your energy here. This is not your energy. Let's see. Um, let's. I haven't played with these in a. Okay, that didn't sound right. I haven't. I haven't bought these out in a long time. So let's see what's going on, Spirit. Please, for my dear Taurians, let's just uh, clarify these for them. So Taurus, what I can make out here, okay? Dark thoughts. Somebody's having dark thoughts, okay, in their mind, all right, about you moving forward with something something else, someone else, other people, new friend group, your family, you know, supportive connections. I'm feeling like with this picture, what I'm seeing here is a male and a female, okay? And then there's like a lady in the background here looking like she's not paying any attention, but she's watching, okay? 
Take it as it resonates. It could be a man just standing in the shadows. Ding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Y'all saw my face. <laughs> You'd be like, oh, hell no. Nah. But, um, so you coming up out of these dark, this dark energy, okay, with this individual. There's somebody here. There's somebody here because if you look here, there's somebody that hasn't even went through the maze yet. They haven't even went through the change, okay? They haven't even started. So, um, you being in this new supportive connections or meeting new people or getting around new people, okay, it's causing a cycle to close out an old one and then a new one where you're going to have increase. You're having gifts, blessings, okay, abundance, all right? At the bottom of the deck, we have the sacred temple. Yeah, you're connecting with your spirit guides, God, praying. I mean, this is absolutely beautiful, Taurus. This is absolutely beautiful. Present power, okay, is also here. Okay, so Taurus, let's look at the... Blah, 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 blah. Taurus, let's see what's going on here. Dark thought spirit for Taurus. What is this dark thoughts here for Taurus spirit? Okay. Mm. Mm, Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. And then we've got the Ten of Wands in the upright. So Taurus, you're putting down a burden from somebody that is very, very uh, not stable. Okay. Um, just not within money, but in within the mental area too, I feel. Um, their heart chakra is closed. I feel this person's not willing to very very much open up. In their mind, they just feel like they have so much going on. This person's all over the place. Whoever this is, Taurus, you're putting this down. You're putting this burden down. And that's what you've been needing to do for quite some time. Yeah, Queen of Cups at the bottom of the deck to love yourself. You're putting something old down and starting something new here. What's this new supportive connection spirit for Taurus? Ah, okay. New supportive connections here for Taurus spirit. Okay, we got this one. Page of Cups. Okay. So somebody here, Taurus, three of wands at the back of the deck. Somebody here, Taurus, that you put a burden down from is wanting to come back and apologize to you because they see you with someone new and they're willing to fight to get you back. Okay. They see you in something new. Okay. And now they're here with the page of cups with the fish in the cup, you know. Um you know, asking, hopefully, hoping, hoping that you will forgive them uh, for what they've done. But I'm sorry, Taurus, I feel this person has not made any changes, not the kind of changes that are needed for a healthy connection to be with you. I feel this person's still stuck in the same ways, but they see you just with new people or around new energy. And now they want to pull you back out of that and put you where you were. You put this down, okay? Somebody that was not very stable. Yeah, look at here. You became victorious, okay? You succeeded through some heartache, some pain, okay? I'm going to put that right down here with the connections. Um, now someone's seeing you successful. Somebody's seeing you doing better, and they just can't they can't take it. It's like somebody just, and they're still in their dark thoughts about, the, about you. So they're willing to come in and fight. And I don't know why, Taurus, I feel like somebody wants to hurt you all over again. Because it's five of wands with this ten of swords at the bottom of the deck. Someone's seeing that you are doing better. You're succeeding. You've, you've, you've made it through heartbreaks, through backstabbing. Like it's an end. You put an ending to something. You put the burden down. We've got Ten of Wands here. We've got the Ten of Swords here. Those are two tens, endings. Endings from somebody that like to keep you conflicted, like to keep you in competition. Okay, but you've been successful to get the fuck out of that energy. And now they want to come back. Because this page of cups right here is looking towards the dark thoughts. Like somebody wants to say, hey, look, I got dark thoughts, you know, I am a negative individual. I do have bad energy, but I want you to still come back. That's what I'm feeling here, Taurus. Someone has not made the proper, the necessary changes. What do we have for increased spirit for your Taurus? Increase. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Someone's wanting you to come back. Okay, Taurus. We got the, the eight of cups and then we got the five of pentacles in the upright. Eight of cups in the reverse and the five of pentacles in the upright. Taurus, you walked away from something. And someone's wanting you to come back. They're seeing your increase. They see that you're doing better. Like I said, the six of wards. Wards. The six of wands here. Okay, maybe some of that wards or something. <laughs> Shit, I don't know, Taurus. Um, but you closing out that cycle has given you big increase. Spiritually, mentally, and shit, even in your pockets. If y'all ain't seeing that right now, Taurus, y'all got something coming. Okay? And somebody's feeling left out in the cold. All right? This five of pentacles here. Somebody's doing very bad financially, and they're wanting you to come back. Because now they're seeing your increase, okay? The bottom of the deck, we got the three of wands. Like, somebody's waiting on you. Let's get one more for increase, spirit. One more for increase. For Taurus. Okay, yeah, four of pentacles. They're holding on tight. 
four to the five. Someone's holding on tight to you because their finances are not doing very well and they want you to come back. The eight of cups in the reverse is either coming back, um, you know, emotions being stuck, okay? Um, being stuck on somebody and I'm getting here that somebody's stuck on you. Somebody from your past, okay? That was a heavy burden. What's these dark thoughts, spirit? Give me one more, please, for dark thoughts. Dark thoughts, spirit. Uh, not that many, but I appreciate it, spirit. Love you very much. Yeah, the star, Taurus. You're healing. You don't put down this this heavy ass burden with somebody very unstable, Taurus. You used to used to have to provide everything for this person, but you didn't mind doing it. Okay, you didn't mind doing it. Now someone's recognizing that you're a star. Their dark thoughts are trying to actually come into your new, your increase, your new connections. The dark is coming back. Okay, I hate to say it that way. No, I don't hate to say it that way. If that's what Spirit's telling me to say, that's what I'm gonna say. I hear, I hear. Um, no light. I'm hearing that. No light. Wow. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> Spirit, can you clarify? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay. I'm just kidding. Spirit, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Please give me some insight on this. Okay, Taurus. Someone's feeling <laughs> stagnant, okay, and imbalanced, okay, while you're having patience throughout this whole process. Somebody needs things fixed, 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 okay? They need to, um, they're feeling trapped where they're at. They're feeling trapped. Their thoughts, all of that thing, all that stuff. Taurus, one thing that you may fail to realize is why you were dealing with this person is you felt that you could get them free from how they feel, how they do things, and you could get them into a different type of perspective. Let me add some pulse on though, because, uh, uh, no. <laughs> okay, let me just... Let me just say that. Let me let me just say no for a second here. Somebody's really dark here, Taurus, okay? And that's why I believe that you and this person probably didn't last long or didn't last forever. This wasn't this wasn't what spirit was intending for you to have to be in the darkness. <laughs> To be in the darkness. No. No, 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 Taurus. No. Spirit's like, uh uh. We gotta fix this. We gotta get this done. What's going on? Why is Taurus doing this to themselves? Here we are to help. You know, like, you guys have some, y'all have a spiritual team or something around you. <clears throat> Spirit, could please keep Taurus's energy protected. Okay, during this reading. May they have clarity, but also be protected. Thank you, Spirit, so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, um, so somebody's really like, they're not feeling free, Taurus, and they're very imbalanced. I told you when I got this Queen of Pentacles in the reverse, somebody here is just like stuck mentally. They're not, they're not there. They're not there. But you've been having patience with yourself, Taurus. You've been having patience with the situation for quite some damn time. And now the patience has ran out. Taurus, please do not feel sorry because you don't have patience to stick around for somebody's whole lifetime. Let your life fly by while somebody wants to play games and be unstable and not know what they want. Okay. Yeah, surrender. You surrender this shit to the universe. You done gave it away. You just said, look, universe, uh, take this. I'm ready to move forward. I'm ready to get my, my wishes fulfilled. Okay, I'm ready to get into the knowing. I don't like being in the unknown, Taurus. I don't think you guys like being in the unknown. You don't like change. You don't like change. And there's no reason, look, guilt in the reverse. No longer feeling guilty, Taurus. Good, because I was hoping this was going to come out. Because you're following your purpose. And you know what your purpose is doing is actually having you meet new people. You might meet a new connection towards a very beautiful connection where someone's going to support you as you support them. There is no in and outs. There is no maybes. There is none of that bullshit. It's somebody that's clear and ready. This person here is not clear and ready. They're a burden. They put a lot on you, okay? Towards whether you recognize that or not, Spirit had to pull you away from this dark energy so you can see just how much of the light you brought to the table. And now that you're no longer in this in, in this. It, area and it's dark now somebody's realizing just how dark they are but they're still willing to come and offer you this it feels like a a, a, a fake apology like it's like well i guess i'm sorry but maybe next time you need to make sure that you do what i say or something it just feels like it's it's sly it's ugly and someone wants to bring you right back into competition and in mind and mind fucks and screws and things like that but Taurus, you already made it out of there the six of wands okay this ending you successfully triumphed this ending, okay? And now this increase you have, someone's out in the dark. They're out in the dark, the cold. They don't have enough money. Their money's very small, okay? But they're holding on to you tight for your life. This person will get probably, uh, <clears throat> probably doing a lot to make themselves look good to have you come back to them. They're probably doing a lot to ca causing them to become broke. 
to try to make it like they have an increase, okay? But they're really holding on tight to their money. Like, literally, their butt cheeks are clenched together, okay? But you're following your purpose, and you're starting to see the lighter things of this life. You're starting to see the lighter things. You're starting to understand, well, that had to happen for this to happen, and things like that. Taurus, you're following your purpose. In no way in heck should you feel guilty. Yeah, look at that. Someone's unhappy because you're about to get in your stability. These new connections you're creating, Taurus, we got the sun in the reverse. Could be dealing with the Leo. Could be dealing with the uh, Virgus, Tor uh, Virgus. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Could be dealing with the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Okay, Leo, Aries, Sag. It's all here, okay? But somebody's like not happy that you're about, yeah, King of Swords in reverse. Somebody really, I said this, this apology, this page of cups here is fake. It's bullshit. Somebody really wants to come and be arrogant and an asshole-ish to you because they're right at the beginning of the, the they can't get through the maze. They can't. They can't. And they've done this to themselves. Okay? This is something that they've done to themselves. Spirit, let me get one sacred destiny oracle, okay? Just real quick before we start the tarot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Taurus. Stay in the light, bro. Sis. Do whatever you have to do to stay in the light. <laughs> because when you were in this dark place, I mean, nobody was giving a damn. Now you get an increase, and now you notice who you are. Now everybody wants to be on your team. Nah, bruh. It don't work that way. Should have noticed me when you had me. And these people, this person, didn't. Some of you guys, is a family. This ten, it could be like five to ten people. Because there's five of wands here. Spirit one card, please. Oh, there we go. Taurus, we have abundance. A beautiful, beautiful card. Abundance. All this has made you abundant. You following spirit, doing what the heck you're supposed to do. Okay? Gateway at the bottom of the deck. And then we got action. You walking through that gateway. You getting where you... Look at this bit of beautiful unicorn. Look at that. Look at that, Taurus. That's you. Unique. Beautiful. Okay? Action is being taken. You gonna go out there and swim. You don't give a motherfucker if you have a life jacket or not. You ready to get the fuck out of this energy. And look what you did. You're successful with doing it. And now someone wants to come back and, and they want to fuck with your energy. You're doing very much better in life. Okay. All right, spirit. Let's get these uh, six of swords at the bottom of this deck here. I haven't took these out in a long time, you guys. But I thought I want to do the good cards today. <laughs> Y'all like Lauren. Come on. What you gonna do with that? Look, man. Look, Taurus. Oh, damn. Look, we're going to shuffle these, okay? The best way we can. Yeah, see? We got this in the bag, Taurus. We got this in the bag. I got the door, Tor. Okay. Taurus, let's see. Let's see what's going to come out, because damn. Oh, look at this, Taurus. The emperor in the reverse and the star in the reverse. Someone is not healed. I told you. They're still at the beginning stages of trying to get themselves together, but they've been so busy pocket watching you that they have made no look at this. Look at this ace this uh this uh page of pentacles, okay. Oh, knight of pentacles, okay, knight, knight, knight. Um versus this emperor in the reverse. A narcissist you're dealing with. Someone sees you as fresh supply okay Taurus somebody just you gotta understand Taurus when a narcissist devalues you okay when they devalue you okay it is not something to be happy about when they come running back don't be happy about that shit it's just because they didn't just try to go search every damn kingdom they could and they ain't found you they didn't start, try to search and you know dip in other dip in and out of people's beds man abundance is here for you Taurus the magician, look at this, Taurus. The devil in the reverse. The nine of swords in the upright. And the sun in the reverse. Judgment in the reverse. And king of pentacles in the reverse. And the five of wands in the reverse, Taurus. Now, now, at the bottom of the deck, we got the fool. Aries energy. Could be an Aries, Taurus, Cusper. You don't have to be. You don't have to be. Look at that. Huh. Uh, let, 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 let's just go ahead and put it this way, Taurus. Look at that. You are going into the, the abundance, okay? The abundance card came out from you from the Destiny Oracle. Sacred Destiny Oracle. Look at that. Abundance. You're walking right to it, Taurus. I'm leaving those out. Look, the King of Swords in the reverse. The Hierophant in the reverse. Somebody very, very noncommittal, okay? They don't want to commit. They want to come in and pretend like they do. Oh, no, nigga, we ain't dealing with pretenders. 
You don't like me using the N-word? Get the fuck out. Okay. Anywho, Taurus, somebody here wants to, they made the wrong judgment. They got with somebody else that is not uh, stable whatsoever. They thought something was more prettier. They made the, bad, the, the worst choice that they could make. It was a bad judgment, okay? This is what I'm getting here. Judgment in the reverse, King of Pentacles in the reverse, and the Five of Wands in the reverse. So this person making this stupid choice, I'm just gonna say stupid because it is a stupid choice. They made a stupid ass decision. Okay, it could be dealing with the they could be dealing with an earth sign. Okay. Somebody making a bad judgment, okay, made you not get out this competition area. Look at this. This five of wands in the reverse. You ain't playing anymore. You ain't fighting anymore. Somebody still is fighting. We got somebody underneath here. Okay, underneath this King of Pentacles, okay? In the reverse. With the Five of Wands in the upright, because they see you in a caring connection with the Ten of Swords and the Page of Cups and the Six of Wands. We know that. But look, you, somebody made a bad decision. They went towards somebody that's just mentally unstable as they are. They are. This person is just as money hungry as they ass is. How the hell does that work? Two money, money hungry motherfuckers together. It doesn't make no sense to me. And then you saw, okay, well, you choose something else. So I'm going to Five Wands my ass out of the mix, okay? Y'all can build this old unstructured motherfucker house yourself. Remember at the bottom of this deck, Taurus, we saw the four wands, okay, with the sun in the reverse. Somebody's upset because you done dropped out and left their ass. You done with this shit here. This is some bullshit. People always, somebody's always choosing somebody over you. And then come to find out that that person, ain't, the person they choose is not always the stable person. So then they act like they done got no, you know, like they're not battling anything. They pretend like, oh, there's nobody else in the background. There's plenty in the background, Taurus, and you were in the middle of it. And you didn't know. You got the fuck out. You're patient enough. Somebody here is stuck, though. Freedom in the reverse. You're not feeling guilty any longer towards leaving this person behind, as you should not. Okay? Your increase is not going to determine if somebody should be in your life or not. You don't look at people like that, so why should they do you that way? Fuck them. Now here we got the, uh, the magician. Okay? We got the devil in the reverse. We got the nine of swords in the upright and the sun in the reverse. Somebody is so unhappy, Taurus, because you are manifesting what you want. Somebody's so unhappy because they're trying to manifest you back in because they made a bad judgment and it ain't working. You done escaped this toxicity. Like I said underneath these other cards, you done escaped something. Taurus, you should be grateful. Somebody's up at night. They can't, they, they up at night, Taurus. They stress the fuck out. They're stressed out. There is no other way to put it. They cannot sleep. They cannot sleep. Why? Because you escaped being bound to them. Look at this. They mad and shit. You done escaped the devil. You done unhooked yourself from this chain, Taurus. You's not, you're not playing with this no more. Uh-uh, no, motherfucker, no. No. And now somebody's unhappy. They're unclear of how. How did you escape, Taurus? How did you get out? How? How, how the F did you, did you walk out of my life? How did you get out of my life? And then suddenly you just got these increases and stuff. When, when, you, when I was around you, you didn't like you had too much. You know, when I was around you, you weren't worthy of my time. Oh, but now... You done got away from me. Oh, you think you're going to get away that quickly? Here I come. Taurus, keep manifesting. You are a natural manifester. Okay, this is absolutely beautiful. You manifested your way out of this situation, out of this, this repetitive cycle bullshit. Somebody decides, oh, you know, Taurus, I'm here forever. I'm going to stay. We're going to make love. We're going to have children, get married. And then suddenly something comes along. Ooh. And they run over there like, there's my manifestations I've been wanting. And they made the wrong judgment yet again. Taurus, you're fed the fuck up. You unhooked yourself from this motherfucking chains. Okay? It, it, it doesn't matter what's going on here. This person is now stuck with someone else. And this toxicity. And someone wants to bring you back and chain you at the neck. No, Taurus. No. And they're stressed out. They sit up at night trying to figure out how to come back. How to come back. Because they know what the fuck they did. Don't let this person come to you. Well, I don't really understand why we broke away. Motherfucker, if you lie again, you lie again, okay? Taurus, I wouldn't even say nothing to this person if they come back. They need to talk to you badly because they're unhappy. They're trying to figure out to, a way to make you unhappy. The sun in the reverse. They're up at night, okay? They're unhappy now. The, 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 the roles have changed. Things have switched in your favor. This increased card up underneath here. No Taurus. There are five of pentacles, the four of pentacles, and the, the eight of cups in the reverse. Uh-uh. Someone wants to come back because they're, they, what they chose is unstable and financially unstable, mentally unstable, and they just like them. They met their fucking match. And now they upset. How did Taurus slip away? Because this person being, this person being here, excuse me, guys, I gotta straighten my face. Okay, there we go. Um, okay, so this, this, 
How the fuck did Taurus escape? That's what I'm feeling here. Somebody is stuck and unbalanced. Taurus, the dark thoughts under there, they're, they're stuck. But look what's at the bottom of the deck, which you're not really seeing, Taurus, which I think you are. Because I think you guys are smart, to be honest. Because you like stability, Taurus. You like things to be in order. You like things to be the way they need to be. If changes keep coming up and down and things like that, one person makes up their mind, you're like, okay, we settled. We made this decision, okay? We basically verbally signed this contract, okay? Then they turn around, they're doing something else, and you're like, damn, I'm scratching your head. What, what did I miss here? I don't know, is it just me? Or is it every time that I make something official with this person, they fucking make me pissed off. They do something to just make me feel less than. Taurus, no. It wasn't just your head. It was this motherfucking person. They're toxic. They're toxic. You had to get away. Somebody that's this stable, somebody that wants this, wants to walk into a legacy, wants to walk into an empire, and it wants abundance in the proper way, not running around all over town, uh, testing out different people in different beds and things, and then finding out, oh, man, there ain't nothing. Let me go back to Taurus. No, motherfucker. you, <laughs> No. <laughs> it's not going to happen. Taurus, you're walking into the abundance that you've always wanted. There's other people, other connections, other people out there that really, really do want to see you succeed. You may have some family that's in disagreement with your abundance, but who gives a mother F? I'm telling you, Taurus, you've already been here where you please everybody. You manifested this. You manifested this. It didn't come, it didn't come into fruition with this dirty, dark person, but spirit separated you from this person to show you just how much they, they, they made the wrong judgment. They decided, oh, well, you know, I'll do whatever I want. A lot of you found out this person was cheating. You found out you were part of a third party. Okay, I feel that deeply here. Some of you found out through information through a cell phone or through some video you saw. Or you looked through somebody's phone and saw if there were other people that were listed as fucking different companies. I'm not joking, you guys. I, you can laugh. But some of you have found out that you were listed under a different... You couldn't figure it out. Why was Domino's or somebody always calling every time? It wasn't Domino's. It was somebody else. It was somebody else. It's, it's a company where they made it look like a scam call or something. And when it would come in, they'd be like, look, scam call. They'd have it up. This person was, they were smart but sloppy. Smart but sloppy. They want to take your power from you. They don't want you to be uh, feeling great. They don't want you doing none of that. None of that. Nothing. Nothing. Let's get a... Uh, I mean, I don't think I need to clarify these cards here. It's very plain sight. They're big and you can see. You can see exactly what's going on here. This is ridiculous, Taurus. If I were you, I'd be very grateful to my to the heavens. Whatever your religion is, you need to be grateful they got you up out of this bullshit. Your guardian angels, you got somebody on your side. And I don't think you realize just how, how hard they rock with you. How hard in the paint they go for you. I'm serious. I am very serious. Because this dark-ass person was going to keep you in this loop for quite some time, Taurus. I mean, look at this. You done made some changes, and they still doing dumb shit. They still got people in the background fighting over them and stuff. But this person, the thing is, they don't want any of these options. None of these people fighting over them. They want you. They want to tie you down. They want to keep you bound. Why, Taurus? Because you're of the light. You could be a chosen uh, divine being. And somebody of the dark, of course, is going to want to take that and, and try to put you in this cage and trap you and make it seem as if, okay, well, this is my gift. No, motherfucker, this ain't your gift. I'm a human being. Who the hell do you think you are? No. <laughs> no, no, no. And now they're stressed. They're stressed out. So they can't figure out a way to get up in your energy, Taurus. They can't figure out a way to get your energy, to take your increase. Look, we got increase over there with the five of pentacles and the four of pentacles. Somebody's holding on to you, Taurus, for the simple fact your money's going to be looking good. And if it ain't already, it's going to be. Trust me, Taurus. Don't fall for that bullshit. Because where they went, broke. Lord, Spirit, you know I'm not manifesting that for you. None of my Taurus is here, but that's what someone's going through. That Five of Pentacles is speaking loudly. Someone's wanting you to come back because they need something. Money. It doesn't have to just be money. It could be. I feel like money's ex. I, I can't. I can't go away from that. I, I just tried, you guys, and I can't steer away from what I just saw. What I'm, what I'm seeing here, okay? I can't. We got Ascending the Mountain. Keep going forward, Taurus. Look at that. Oh, my nails are ugly. Keep going forward, all right? My baby Taurine. Gates of triumph. Success expands in your life. Taurus, I told you this person's around for the wrong reasons. Things are happening for you. And now they want to come in and shoot the poop. No, 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 no. 
with that baby cup apology. I just don't like it, Taurus. I don't. Infinite abundance. This is the second time we didn't have the abundance card come out. Look at this. Abundance here, Taurus, okay? And infinite abundance. Abundance is pouring into your life. Look at this beautiful energy, Taurus. Somebody can sniff it. They know. They could be getting readings on you. Okay, this person could be doing... Okay, yeah. This person could be doing some toxic magic. When I say toxic magic, I mean some, some negative energy thrown towards you or doing something they have no fucking idea. But they're getting all every bit of lick of what you got going on in your life. And I think this person's being told to leave you the fuck alone and they're not going to listen. They're not going to listen. Some of you. Okay? Miracles. Expect the wondrous to emerge. Look at that. Miracles. It's a miracle you got the fuck up out of these chains with this devil, you guys. That's not something easy to battle, might I add. People that try to get away from toxic energy and toxic situations, it's not an easy thing. It's very complicated. Okay? And then we have distant thunder. Clear the air. Somebody here wants to come in and clear the air, Taurus, but it's distant thunder. Look at that distant thunder. It's a distance. It's at a distance. It's thunder. It's coming in to crash in some shit. Nope. Because why? You got all these beautiful things. Ascending the mountain. Keep going forward. Gates to triumph. Success expands in your life. Infinite abundance. Oh my goodness. Abundance is pouring into your life, Taurus. Miracles. Expect the wonders to emerge. And then clear the air. Somebody here wants to come clear the air, Taurus. But there ain't no air to clear. Because this person should not be in your space. They want to be so bad in your energy, they want to come towards you with some bullshit. I'm telling you. And then before you know it, Taurus, it's looking like it's all sunny and pretty right here, right? But look how this woman's looking out there to that thunder. Warning. She's getting herself prepared. She knows what's coming. Be very clear, Taurus. Be very clear-minded. Because this abundance that you're walking into, okay, is definitely meant for you. You manifested this. You manifested. You probably didn't know you were even manifesting it, Taurus. You're probably thinking, oh, my dear Lord, can I just please have the love of my life? Somebody come along and value me. I'm tired of having headaches. I'm tired of wondering if I'm good enough. I'm tired of feeling left out. I'm tired of hurting. I'm tired, tired, tired. Let's get a monology. One. Spirit. Okay. Hold your vision. Hold your vision, Taurus. Hold on to that vision. Because you're making new connections here. You're making new connections with someone or some people. And it's causing you to start getting out of that energy where you feel less than and all that. It's getting you out of that. You're getting out of that situation. We're done here with that shit. My baby Torian's knocking, so that is giving me confirmation. Taurus, that's been your reading, my loves. I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope that you hit the thumbs up, okay? Even the thumbs down if you got to, okay? Um, please uh, put... If you're not, if you're new here, please go on ahead and subscribe. I'll be grateful for your subscription. Okay. Thank you so much for the views. Thank you for being here. You all, I do see your comments and I love every single one of them. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, sending love, 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 hugs and kisses. Okay. Everybody keep loving yourself towards and keep going forward. Hold that vision. All right. You got it. You're right there. Somebody's trying to come in and just swoop it all away. They're not worth it, Taurus. Not one bit. I love you guys with all my heart. Talk soon. Bye-bye, Taurus.